Hi, this is Craig Berkey, um, Ag Sales Professional at Castonia Tractor, sitting here in a new 9R series tractor, and today we're going to talk about Efficiency Manager and the way you can customize the transmission in this 9R for fuel savings, um, all, the, all the functionality it affords from custom to automatic. So we're going to demonstrate that as best we can. Okay, well we've got an 18 speed electronic power shift transmission here that we can run in a couple different ways and to start with, we'll just focus on how you can run this in straight manual mode. So depress the clutch and take it out of park into neutral and you've got your forward ranges and your reverse ranges. So you can put it in a forward speed, the corner post shows that we're in seventh right now. I can adjust my engine RPM manually let out the clutch and then and then drive forward. I can shift up or down or I can shift into reverse without using the clutch. This has a reverser built into it. So I can I can run the tractor in straight manual mode by selecting the best combination of forward ground speed and engine RPM to to do whatever job I'm trying to do. Okay, so now if we've um, decided we'd like to run the tractor in efficiency manager there's some other tools at our disposal here the first which you'll notice that the gear shift lever actually has a speed dial knob on it and then we have two buttons here we have a one and a two which are uh, as you and you'll see in a minute are where we're going to assign a ground speed to efficiency manager um, in addition we have a shortcut key on the command center display which takes to us to our transmission uh, page and you'll see we have a variety of choices here. We can run this in manual, custom, or full auto mode. Um, for right now, we'll start in manual mode. And then we're going to, what we're going to do is, is assign a, a ground speed to a range. As you can see here right now, our F1 speed is assigned at 4.4 miles an hour. And I can change that at any time if I want to set that at, I, just by moving this speed dial. But for our purpose today, I'm going to leave that at 4.4. And then I've got F2 at, let's just increase that to 5.4. So now I have two legitimate, you know, field work speeds entered in as set speeds that I'm going to ask the tractor to run at those speeds when I, when I activate Efficiency Manager. Now, I'm going to take the throttle and move it all the way up. And at that point, I am done with the throttle. My job is done. The computer inside the tractor is gonna calculate the most efficient speed for the job that's being done based on the set speed that I select with Efficiency Manager. Okay, so to start with, I'm gonna be in full manu manual mode here. And I'm in seventh gear, and I'm gonna drive four and a half miles an hour, as close as I can get to that, at full RPM. So I'm gonna shift down. So I'm in fifth gear at 2,240 RPMs in manual mode. The tractor is working hard. As you can see, I'm using almost 10 gallons an hour. Now, when I activate Efficiency Manager, I had pre our preset, I had asked for four and a half miles an hour. So now it has regulated both the engine RPM down to 1580 and changed the gear up to eighth gear. And you can see our fuel usage has dropped by almost 50%. Uh, so it's, it's shift up, throttle back, but it's automatic in a way that makes constant adjustments. And as the tractor load would change in the field, um, the tractor would regulate engine RPM and uh, the gear it's in for the most efficient setting possible. I'll make my turn here. So uh, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna switch back out of efficiency manager mode. Notice because my throttle is all the way up, my engine, my engine RPM is gonna spike again now. And it switches me back to five miles an hour, or rather fifth gear, four and a half mile an hour, full RPM like we used to drive our tractors. And my fuel usage again spikes to almost 10 gallons. In this, in this little trial here, that's almost double of what it was before. Okay, another, another function here that we can utilize is our full auto mode, which I went to my transmission page. I was previously in manual. Now I'm in full auto. And here, I'm gonna set it into gear. And once I do this, now I'm, I'm, in, I'm driving. And now I can use this set speed dial to change my ground speed. When I straighten out here, you'll see right now I'm going 4.4. 
So now I ask it for five just by doing that. And now the efficiency manager is recalculating the engine RPM and the gear. That's the most efficient setting. Again, I'm gonna roll my speed dial up years and I'm not moving my shift at all. I'm just, I can roll it forward or backward, either way, four and a half, five, and the tractor is doing what it can to give me what I'm asking for here. So that's another cool feature of Efficiency Manager. To recap, um, I guess Efficiency Manager is just another one of those um, features in a new 9R series tractor that's gonna let you optimize your experience and efficiency um, in your transmission settings kind of taking uh, performance to the next level and, and also giving you fuel economy uh, in the process. So I guess uh, thanks for your attention and let us know if there's any way we can demonstrate to this, this to you in the field.